Okay. So hello there everyone. Um my friends especially my friends on console. There are a couple of my friends on console and one of my friends who plays on PC using HDMI and myself. We all want to know whether HDMI can do 165 Hz. And if you're watching this video, you probably do too. So, um, there's going to be a video linked down in the description that I want you guys to go check out after you're done with this video, of course. But, um, that is by Steve from Gamers Nexus, um, saying that HDMI has an 18 gigabyte capacity, HDMI 2.0, sorry, has an 18 gigabyte capacity of data and of data at one time being transmitted and that there's a 600 megahertz clock. So this is not just 165 hertz. So this is this is 120 hertz, which obviously it can, because HDMI 1.4 can do that. But um, this is going to be 144, which it can, because I'm using HDMI at 165 right now. Well, I don't know if it's 165 or 144, but my monitor says it's 165. So um, Steve from Gamers Nexus, he has said that. Um, actually, let me move, let me move my OBS over here. But, um, Steve from Gamers Nexus has said, um, that, uh, dude, can I type in calculator? There we go. Steve from Gamers Nexus has said that HDMI 2.0 has a 600 megahertz capacity budget, whatever it's called, core clock or whatever. It's not core clock. But, um, this is going to be for 1920 by 1080 because yeah that's just my resolution but um um i have reasoning behind this so hdmi 2.0 can do 4k 60 hertz and um that's a fact we all know that and um 4k looks four times as fine as 1080p because 4k um, 1920 is half of 4K's horizontal lines, which 4K has 3840, and, um, 1080 is half of, um, 4K's 2160 horizontal, or vertical lines, so that results in half and half, resulting in, um, half of each being one fourth or four times which means 1080p is one fourth of it but um aside from the math it, i got a calculator up here um so it can, hdmi can also probably do 1440 144 i'll cover that here in a sec but um if we do 1920 oh my god i suck jesus and i'm locked if we do 1920 times 1080 equals 2.07 million pixels 1 million pixels equals a megahertz for um video signals so now we have 2 million and now if we multiply this by 144 jesus okay two okay 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 i did not think this out very clearly but um if we just do this and then times 144 that equals 298 megahertz or probably closer if we're rounding up 299 megahertz and if we want to round up to the nearest 10 300 megahertz so th theoretically we could do 288 hertz if we tried hard enough but it's not recommended that you go anywhere it's not recommended that you go and push on that limit, which it still technically wouldn't be pushing because you'd still probably be, probably be two or three megahertz below the 600. But um, now if we do 1920 by 1080, multiply that by 165, and we have 3.42 Jesus million or 342 million, sorry, which is 342 megahertz we're still below that 600 megahertz clock so theoretically if we do the math 
1920 by 1080 by 240. Let's take a look. 497 megahertz. So we are below 600 megahertz on 1920 by 1080. So 1080p, 1080p 240 hertz. We are below the 600 megahertz by a sixth of that, by a sixth of the megahertz minimum maximum clock. So theoretically, mathematically, HDMI can do 240 hertz. Jesus, my sister's humming. But um. That doesn't mean that the HDMI on your monitor is always going to be 2.0, HDMI 2.0. So make sure you're getting the right HDMI when you buy your monitor. But, um, yeah, mathematically, HDMI 2.0 can do 1080p 240Hz. So now we're going to get into 2560 by 1440. So if we do 2560 by 1440, by 144. 530 megahertz. There you go. And we might be able to squeeze in 165, but it's definitely not going to be able to do 240 because based on what I'm seeing here, we're about just a little bit over half of 240 by about 24. Which is a tenth of it, but you know what I, you know what I mean. We're basically at half a two forty kind of, but um, we're at five hundred thirty megahertz. So now if we do this and we do twenty five sixty by fourteen forty by one hundred sixty five hertz. Oof, oof. HDMI mathematically, you could probably do it. But it would probably really hurt your HDMI ports and cables. Or it just wouldn't work at all. I don't know. I've never tried because I never owned a 1440p 165Hz monitor because this is my very first tire refresher monitor that I'm on right now. And it's 1080p 165Hz. But, um, no. Uh, HDMI cannot do 1440 165Hz. But. I most people really won't notice a difference between 144 and 165 hertz. I notice a slight difference, but not big enough for me to want to not big enough for me to really care. Uh, um, because it's like half a millisecond. So, but that's basically it. HDMI can HDMI 2.0 theoretically, mathematically can can do um 1080p 240 hertz. And theoretically and mathematically, once again, it can do 1440p, 144 hertz. And another common refresh rate that I guess we could try, is, which I bet you will work, is 2560 by 1440 by 155. Because 155 I have seen on some ASUS monitors. And yes, it can do that, but that's just quick math. But um, we're just going to stick to 165. But 1440. 144 is possible over HDMI 2.0 mathematically, and um, 1440 155 is also possible over HDMI 2.0. I'm not going to fine tune it to get your maximum refresh rate because, really, if I'm being honest, 10 hertz isn't going to make a difference if you're already on a high refresh rate monitor. But if you're on a 60 hertz monitor, yeah, 10 hertz will obviously make a difference, but y you know what I mean. But, um, it, HDMI cannot do um, 1440p 165. That's probably going to still be until 2022 when we see that, when HDMI 2.1 is mainstream. So, um, I hope you guys found this video informational and helpful in any way, shape, form, mathematically or anyways, because I think I probably just did the math that you were worried about. And, um, yeah, this video is found basically nowhere on YouTube. Nobody has made a video like this, at least out of like the hundred different searches I've done. So, um, if, yeah, if this helped you, please consider liking, subscribing, and, um, 
yeah, I'm looking at the stop recording button. But, um, yeah, consider liking, subscribing, and, um, yeah, overall, HDMI can do 1080p, 240Hz. At least, theoretically, and mathematically, that is.